Yeah, fish on. Yeah. To Barbel. Yes, Get in there! Oh. Get in there! <laughs> Beautiful. My <laughs> first ever river barbel. I think that's it, isn't it? Yeah. I think we're done. For me, Come unfortunately, out. it has to be next yeah. next time. I'm gutted that you didn't feel that fight, but I'm really looking forward to getting out with you again and yeah. uh, getting you on one. Yeah. You've got the next one. Yeah. You're on the next one. Yeah. <sighs> Wicked, man. Today is the day that I catch my first river barbel. Fish on! Go get the net! And just oh, you've right. wiped everything out. You've wiped everything out. For pretty much the winter now, I've wanted to catch a barbel. And the first session that we came down, Sean had one, and it was great. Unlucky it wasn't my turn on the rods, but I'd had a chub earlier in the day. On this same stretch, we're on the River Avon. And it seems that with this stretch, potentially not a lot of barbel come out, but some big barbel come out. And we've had a lot of wind and rain. We had that massive storm and it put all the rivers out. And we've been trying through it. We went to the seven and it was just, you know, the leads wouldn't hold bottom. It just schooled us really of, of what's what. It just really difficult fishing. Um, so we're back on the Avon and the Avon's come down a little bit and I just, I've been dreaming about catching a barbel. Dreaming. We've done a night here and it was minus five when we woke up. It was absolutely savage. We've done a couple of sessions where we've stayed till about 10, 11 o'clock at night, ate food here and, and all that stuff on a barbecue. And that's what we're doing today. We're, we're gonna stay until about 10, 11 o'clock um, before we were fishing on straight leads, but this time we're on feeders. Um, a bit of ground bait, you know, a bit of micro pellets and uh, fishing on meat. It's muddy as anything. I've already fell over a few times. And I'm just hoping and praying now that I catch a barbel before the river season closes. I really would love a barbel. Apparently barbel don't like cold water. I know that, but I'm here and I'm trying. So if you could all put your fingers together, crossed, thanks Sean, and let's all say the barbel prayer together. Sweet, so uh, I should get one now. I got the barbel rods behind me here. They're holding on tight. I've decided to sit away from them from the session and not even look at them and just listen to the whistling wind for the bite and the lawnmower. What happened? Think, of, think it just took it down a bit. Yeah. Bit of action there, Tom. Oh, wow, well, a few bleeps. Um, I was just concentrating on the reel to see what that was doing, to see the speed of it rather than the tip. Because on the river, this height can be difficult, can't it? But no, according to the... Uh, no fish. I got down here though, didn't I? You did, mate. Well done. Sharpish. Oh, a bit of excitement. That was the first. It's been beeping off. It's been given a bit of. Woo, I think that the... we've got the free spool on, haven't we? And the yeah. current's been taking it a bit. Yeah. You never know if there's something under there that's pulling it either, you know, drift. A little bit of action. Not bad. Yeah, it's gone a bit rainy, isn't it? And uh, here we go. Recast 
recast on that one. Yeah, I am about to recast them. Yeah, I reckon so. You'll, you'll, you would have just noticed Sean saying he's recasting them. I'm first up on both rods. So well done, Tom. All four rods. All four rods. It's a good friend that is, are you? Right, get that one recast then, Sean. Yeah, we'll do. There's the one. And uh, do you know what? There's a couple of chunks of meat lying around in the middle. Just gonna put that in the middle. Squash some ground bait in there. You know, you can really pack it in, but we're just lightly packing the edges, aren't we? So that yeah. actually some gets out and gets found. Yep. All right then. This rain's not good, is it, mate? No, it's not the best, but it can't be bad for the fishing, surely? You'd think so, wouldn't you? What did he say? Hey. Oh. <laughs> What's happened? Fish on! Fish on! Yes, Tom! Yes, Tom! I'm in the river. Fish on! Yeah. Oh, wait there, the other line. Go get the net. Oh. It's a chub. Oh, it's a chub! Yeah. Oh. It's a nice chub, though, bro. Oh. oh, oh, it's in. Oh, <laughs> mate. Oh. I slid down I'm there. <laughs> and just oh, you've wiped <laughs> everything out. You've wiped everything out. Wow. We were just putting stuff in the van because it's absolutely tipping it down. And do you want to sort your life out and help me out? Yeah. 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 Oh, this is a death peg. That's a, that's a PV chub anyway. It's a <laughs> yes, PV chub. Yes, <laughs> yes. Right, leave that rod there. I'm just looking down at this chub and it looks like a thick fish. I haven't caught many chub. I caught one on some maggots a couple of years ago, but this looks like a PB chub. I know it's not a barbell, but do you know what? It's a PB. I came, I took it, and I rubbed it. <sighs> Sorry, she's got to be overexcited there. Oh, I'll tell you what, right? Look at this. Oh, yes, mate. Thick chub. <laughs> About four or five pounds, I reckon. Whee! What a fish. Really nice looking chub, mate. Well done. Beautiful. Not a barbel, but it's it's a good size. It's not a barbel. It's a PB. I'm going to weigh it and see how big it is. Go for it. I think three, four. Oh. Oh, wow. Five pound eleven. So we'll weigh the the sling after, but it's not going to be much, is it? Five uh, slings about a pound, I reckon, mate. One last look. <sighs> yes, well happy with that PB chub from the Avon. Round about five and a half pounds, upper five. I'm buzzing actually. Well done, mate. Right, let's get him back. Just let the uh, fish recover for for a couple of minutes. Lovely, gonna get a photo on my phone. Right then, PB Chubb, see you later. 5.11, we'll go and weigh the sling now, see what that says. PB Chubb, off you go. Pike smash. See you later, all this stuff over here. Raining, banks are getting slippier even though they were super slippy anyway. So. It's always fun to see you take a dive down a bank, mate. Recast. Yep. Barbel, but happy chub. So like the video. What's this discussion now going to be about who's on the rod next? Because this is what happened the last tr the, the time we actually caught a barbel. No, it is. <laughs> no, it is. Let's talk about that off camera. <laughs> <laughs> well, we want to fight about it off camera. Is well, that I'm what just it is? going to have sail there. All right. Oh, 11. No, nah, 11. So it's 11. <laughs> it's a 12. 11, five pounder. Five pound chub. <laughs> Get this state here. My muddy. Yeah. Right then, who's next on the rod? Thank you. Wow. 
you know, how many times have we been barbell fishing now and not caught and it's been you on the rods the entire time? About six or... Four, yeah. maybe four times. Okay, yeah, you, you, you crack on on the and, rods. you know, the good sign is, Tom, that when we actually caught a barbell before, all them millions of minutes ago... Yeah. ...that we caught a chub first. You caught a chub, do you remember? I did. So, maybe it... this time, history's repeating itself. Yeah, I mean, this rain is, is savage. Um, we've got, I'm getting a bit hungry, are you? Yeah, I'm getting hungry. And uh, we've got a barbecue. I mean, the rain is easing off a little bit now. Uh, you know, even I still if... don't think you could get a barbie in it. But... Yeah, I will but see. I'm hungry, man. Yeah, I want to get the steaks. Okay, you're back up on the rods next. Yeah, I'm back up on the rods, so I'm like a meerkat. <coughs> kind of yeah, thing. so we can't really get out and film. We're, we're kind of sacrificing getting the camera wet when there's uh, fish on the bank, aren't we? Yeah, that's why that, that was just so carnage. Because yeah. the camera was kind of in standby mode. Yeah. And you went abseiling down the bank anyway. So, uh, on one of our previous trips, literally we've tried to do this video about 12 times, uh, I go through what rod and reel that we're using. Uh, thanks to Shakespeare for sending us the rods, the SKP stuff, and sponsoring this video. That was me thanking Shakespeare. Okay, cool, brilliant. And um, so, yeah, let's uh, take you through a nicer evening here on the Avon, where uh, I go through the rods. Right then, I can't be too long because I need to get my rods back in and catch a barbel because I ain't having this, Sean. I haven't caught, I haven't caught a chub this year, guys. You've only caught a chub. Can this everyone year. just, just say a quick prayer for me? A prayer to who? Which god? All the gods. Okay. The old ones and the new ones. Move, you bastards! Quick as you like, gonna take you through rod and reel that I'm using. I'm using the SKP Concept 12 foot, two pound test curve feeder. Barbel rod. Did that in the first take as well, didn't I, Sean? That was outstanding. And I'm using the MX3 free spool 6500 reel with 15 pound mono. Did it again first Wait, time, did didn't it I, again, Sean? Lads. Yo! Keep oh, going, man. don't stop. Okay, us. okay. Uh, what, what's your lead? Yeah, i am got a three ounce lead on. Oh, yeah. And I'm using some meat, right? On a size 10 hook. Ah, it's not a size 10 hook though. No, 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 it's no. a size 6. And I'm using me on a size 6 hook. You can't First edit it time. like that. First time, <laughs> yeah, okay. It's got a little white tip on the top as well to help you out with bite indication. What does it help you out with, Tom? Okay. I'll tell you what, I'm going I'm to say, say some Shakespeare quotes here now. Go on then. To tie in with the Shakespeare concept SKP. You know what I'm saying, kid? All right, fine. Okay then. Friends. Romans, countrymen, lend me your ears. For far too long the barbel have remained in the Avon, and Tom hath not caught one. <laughs> Can you give me something from Macbeth, my favourite? Macbeth, okay. Have I got to do it in a Scottish accent? Oh yeah, oh, right, standard. Is this a dagger, which I see? Wait, 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 this aeroplane's... No. Ruining your Shakespeare festival okay. stuff? Give me another Macbeth. Another Macbeth. Tomorrow. And tomorrow. And tomorrow. Maybe one day I'll catch a barbell. <laughs> Outstanding. Well, I've got to go cast them back in there. Go on then, get them back in. All we need to do now is wait for another fish and you're back up on the rods. I'm ready, mate. Barbell, if you catch a barbell, pow! <laughs> I am going to web sling at this man <laughs> and absolutely fly down that bank. You watching them rods for me there? Yeah? I'm watching them, yeah. Watching yeah. them, watching them down there. Day All early. right then. Another chub. Is it? Another chub. I'll take it. There we go. Yeah! <laughs> Just when the hope was falling. Another chub, I guess. That'll <laughs> get you back on the rods, don't it? <laughs> ah! Bro, I was convinced that was a barbel the way that I went. know, I know. Nice little specimen of a chub. Specimen? 
I don't think it's as big as yours. It's lovely though, mate. Very nice little chub. That rod went off. Mate, don't they take them rods, man? Look at the mouth on ya. <coughs> does that mean I'm back up on the rods there? I had a bit of a moment then. Yeah, it does. <laughs> it does. Come on then, kid. Go on, get to four. Get to four. Oh, come on. That said four a minute ago. Four. Did you see that? Four. Yeah, four pound. Four, four, four pound chub, that is good. Four kid. pound chub. How many ounces are in a pound? <laughs> this light is dropping. It is, man. It's going dark. Might be barbel time. Might be. The light is certainly dropping. Let's hope. Come on. Skate my way down. Wrong way, Rich. turn on the rods you bump so three pound 15 but it said four four yeah yeah turn them off uh right i'm back up on the rods and i mean the light is dropping rapido so let's see but do you know what even if i don't get a barbel i think i think I might have to release this video without no barbeling see me legging it to the rods mate I was I saw this web sling. Oh, and they got cramped there. Just reeled the rods in. Next time. Next time, Sean. Can really see you over there, look. See me with my net. Can you see me waving my net? Just getting here. Got loads of light in here. Alright, hello everyone. Like the video. Your breath stinks. Bye. <sighs> See you next week for another upload, you bums. Friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your ears. For far too long the barbel have remained in the Avon, and Tom hath not caught one. <laughs>